jina la bwana yesu bwana ile kazi yako ya kuongoza hilo ndio tukuja kutoka utukufu na ukaja wewe mwenyewe hapa kwa ile jamii ya Adam Adam Jesus Christ. Sema, ufunuo wa Yesu Kristo. Says blessed is he that 
Andrei Natia, the word of this prophet. Nasema heri yule asikiae na asomae unabii wa unajua kitabu hiki. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 So it is important that we read the Bible, the, the, the word of God. Nema sana kusoma Biblia neno la Mungu. This is a book of prophecy. Na hiki ni kitabu cha unabii. Praise be the name of the Lord. Amen. Amen. So there is blessing by reading and hearing. Kuna baraka kusoma na kuna baraka pia kwa kusikia. We have seen that um um there is a call that has been, been made here. Kwamba kuna mwito ambao umeitano hapo. And and the 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 key word. Na uh, ile neno la kifungua maana ya mwimbo. After this. Baada ya haya. After this. Baada ya haya. After this. Baada ya hii. I lost. Katanzam. After this. Baada ya hii. After what? Baada ya nini? After the church ages. Have been revealed. Amen. First of all, I want you to remember. What is being said here? Was given us in the book of Isaiah. 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 Send this message to the churches in Asia. I am about to send a message to the churches in Asia. They were all established. They were all established. Hallelujah. Amen. Because the uh, most of the books uh, of the Jesus, that Paul wrote, he wrote them between um, AD 54. So AD 64. Alizandika kama mwaka wa 54 na 56 na sita kwa baada ya kifo cha Yesu. Mostly when he was in prison in Rome. Sana alipokuwa kule gerezani kule Roma. So he wrote them. Aliandika hizo nyaraka in Ephesus. Ile nyaraka are we together? Je, ni pamoja? Showing you that the churches were there. So he writes a letter to the Thessalonians. That letter was taken to the Thessalonians. It was written to the Romans. The church in Rome was established. The, the letter was written to the church at Colossae. Colossians were still there, were already there. Another letter was written to the Galatia for the Galatians. The church was already established. In after this night is six. Then the John was at the island of Patmos. When he was in prison there, he was the gospel that he preached and manifested. Hallelujah. While he was there, then God gave this revelation. That's why now after he was called to the island of Patmos, then God started revealing to him. Mungu naye akaanza kutuma kwa revelation of Jesus Christ ule ufunuo wa Yesu Kristo haleluya amen and he gave him akampea he said now this is a blessed thing akasema hiki ni kitu cha baraka sana it's a book of prophecy kitabu cha unabii the things that are being written here mambo ambayo yameandikwa hapa also them are not being fulfilled but yao mengi bado hayajatimizwa haleluya amen are we together kwa pamoja oh glory to god amen oh may god help us mungu anasaidia by that time the only church that we can testify of was the Ephesian church kanisa ambalo ni church kanisa ambalo ni kusema pale kwa kwa kanisa la waifeso amen that was properly established ambalo ilikuwa tayari kanisa the other ones were there lakini yale mengine yalikuwa hapo and so the and so he said now this this letter here take them take them to this church to that church to that church and so on and asema hii waraka hapa tapelekea kanisa lile na lile na lile and so on kuendelea blessed in the after now this church now we give the letter the first one was to the church 
a Ephesus. Alikuwa kwa ujumbe wa kwanza alikuwa kwa ajili ya kanisa la Waefeso. To whom? Kwa kina nani? The messenger of that church. Yule mjumbe wa hiyo kanisa. To give to that church. Yule mjumbe apeane kwa hiyo kanisa. I believe that at that time na mimi kwa kufikia wakati huo the people believe that the, those uh, messages was for that, those churches specifically na naambia kwamba wale walikuwa katika wale waamini kwamba hizo jumbe zilikuwa ni kwa ajili ya hawa kanisa most of them never knew that they were for the church ages baadhi yao wengi hawakuja kwamba hizo jumbe zilikuwa ni kwa ajili ya zile za kati saba za kanisa we are privileged because we are looking at things from half most of the things have taken place. So we know that that mama mambo kwa baadhi ya mengi yashatendeka. Amen. Amen. And so the church came the Smyrna and the, the Pergamum, the Thyatira, the Sardis, the Philadelphia Amen. and the Laodicea. Kisha baadhi sayo ya kaja ni kwata na hilo. Amen. So those messages hizo jumbe were taken to the church to the churches for the church ages hizo zilikuwa kwa ajili ya makanisa kwa ajili ya zile za kati saba za kanisa haleluya amen so after that baada ya hayo na he was in the spirit and then he heard that uh, after this i saw akasema baada ya hii nikaona haleluya amen after he had shown me everything about the church ages baada ya kuja mimi kila kitu kuhusu ya kati saba za kanisa by the way from uh, Revelation chapter 4 toka ufumo mlango ile you don't hear the spirit of God talking about the church how see if I open the wrong of some of us can read the, the book of uh, this book of uh, Revelation all of it up to the end and there's somebody in the book of no kutoka mlango to the mission is not talking about the church anymore kutoka hapa is music kuhusu kanisa tena the picture has changed and ile kwa sira ile bali after this baada ya hayo once all this is done wakati hayo yote yametengwa after this baada ya hayo i saw something nikaona kitu is come up here akasema jo hapa juu now he is being shown that's an audience yeah, listen very carefully is about the king the revelation of jesus christ of nuo wa yesu kristo before kabla in heaven yeah huko juu mbinguni events in heaven mama kitendeka huko mbinguni before kabla they happen here haya tendeka hapo ndio how to get that amen let's say the name of the lord amen because what happens with the ministers in the messengers ile kinachotendeka na wale wajumbe they get the revelation of what has been revealed in heaven but apart of no kila mali before it is revealed here on earth kabla akija kufunuliwa hapa ndio ya they start preaching what they have seen in heaven na wanaanza kuhubiri nyesi hiyo wamekiona kule mbinguni and it produces spiritual or religious war na hiyo jambo inaleta vita vya kiroma vile vya kidini that is what you see in the in the preaching of the prophet in the seven seals uh, from um Uh, the first seal all the way and you know that katika huduma ya nabii tangu ile mwili wa kwanza baba mwisho yote so for the prophet our, our time for the prophet wakati wetu kwa nabii wetu this the religious war didn't start in 1963 vita vya kiroho ama za kidini hazikuanza mwaka 63 when he got the revelation ni wakati alipopata ile ufunuo from 1933 and so on tangu mwaka wa 1933 kuendelea haleluya amen he was now seeing the things that have been revealed in heaven ale alikuwa ameanza kuona yale mambo yale yalifunuliwa kule mbinguni because by at man sunset wakati kule mlima sunset god did not come down with a closed book mungu akusika pale kitabu kilichofungwa and then comes to man sunset aje pale katika mlima sunset na akifungua no la he came down with an open book alishuka alikuwa na kitabu kilichofungwa in heaven yeah it was to be good how it get jeu kwa pamoja amen we are talking about the importance of the breaking of the seal basita kuhusule muhimu wa kugonjwa kwa leo to us kwa hiyo sisi to the believer kwa muamini to you and to me kwa wewe na mimi amen bless you the lord so we 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 hit so many things uh, over the, over the last uh, uh, week days sema mengi sana katika ya juma amen and how important it is to us na vile vile na muhimu sana kwetu amen in the revelation chapter 5 katika ufunuo wa mlango wa tano after he had gone to heaven baada ya ona kwenda and i see um, 
the throne and so on and all the all the elders na wale wazee sina waite the setting that was there in in heaven that we bangalore kwa pale mbinguni remember kumbuka the 24 elders wale wazee sina waite that of them are were tenders baadhi ya wazee walikuwa ni watu wa kimataifa haleluya they were tenders walikuwa ni mataifa kama nani like the messengers kama wale wajumbe haleluya look at it brother sister dame mbuda people like Eremias wala kama vile Eremias was a Frenchman alikuwa ni mtu kutoka kule France was not a Jew hapo wa Yahudi can you see that naweza kuona hiyo and all them like Martin kama wale wengine kina Martin so on na kuendelea na all like the brother of that said kama ni brother of the same yeah they they were changed out all like what maybe maybe they are part of the 24 na pekee sasa na wale wazee sio wao how to get there ndio kwa moja because the bible says so so the bible yasema hivi I put it somewhere. Let us see what it. Let us see what it. In Matthew chapter. Nineteen. Matayo. Lamba kumi na tisa. Verse twenty-seven. Aya ya ishirini na saba. Then answered Peter and said unto him, Behold, we have forsaken the all and followed thee. What shall we have therefore? Hipo Petro akachipo akamwambia, Tazama sisi tumeacha vyote. Tutakuwa kufuata, tutapata nini basi? And Jesus said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me in the regeneration with the Son of Man Uh, shall sit in the, in the throne of his glory he also shall sit upon two thrones two thrones judging the trail of tribes of Israel Yesu akamwambia amini na kuambia kwamba ninyi mlionifuata mimi katika katika ulimwengu uh, Yesu akamwambia amini na kuambia kwamba ninyi mlionifuata mimi katika ulimwengu ya atakapoketi mwana wa Adamu katika kipi chake cha utukufu wake ninyi nanyi mtaketi katika viti 12 mtawahukumu kabila 12 za Israeli haleluya amen blessed be the name of the lord amen so there is a promise that they who will believe like that they will sit in that seat kuendelea ili kumbuka this was in in in, in, in advance ili fanyika kibele and the throne is set like that yani enzi imeekwa namna hiyo amen amen and about uh, chapter 5 so i'm saying this because we most of you are not there when we started it on Wednesday and Friday and so on so bad yenu wengi mkoanza jumatano jumaa kwako amen amen so that we pick up together ili tuweze kuambatana pamoja ah five And I saw in the right hand of him that sat on the throne a book written within and on the back side sealed with the seven seals and I saw a strong angel proclaiming with a loud voice who is worthy to open the book and to lose uh, and to to lose the seals thereof no man in heaven nor in earth neither under the earth was able to open the book neither to look uh, thereupon And I went too much because no man was found worthy to open um, and to read the book neither to look uh, their bond. Amen. Jesus nikaona katika mkono wa mume wake yeye aliyekete juu ya kile kilichaenzi kitabu kilichoandikwa ndani na nyuma nimetua miuri saba. Nikaona malaika mwenye nguvu akihubiri kwa sauti kuu ni nani asailie kufungua kitabu na kuzivunja miuri zake wala hapakuwa na mtu mbinguni wala juu ya enzi 
wala chini ya inchi aliyeweza kufungua hicho kitabu wala kitanzamu Hallelujah. Amen. So the issue was who is worth it. And that's why they were in Nani and I say, You can stand like I am worth it. Nani and it's not an ascent meaning as I do. The key word is who is worth it. But the job of your mother and father in Nani and it's a young man, attention was drawn to the book. But you were home to who was going to get to work with the Kuli Lekedwa, Wakila Kitab. And when the angel saw that he had seen the book, now Katy Maleta and Kora Wama, who you are not a killer, he was shouting, Who is worth it? I'm not a good killer. Kwa nyesha dinari asa yule alie 
Jesus who is called the Lamb of God. You know, it's Jesus Christ. Yeah. And he's the one who was slain. And he's the one who went and took the book. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise be the name of the Lord. Amen. He took the book and he took the book. And when he had taken the book, he said the four beasts and the, uh, the, the four beasts and four, the four beasts and four and twenty elders fell down before the Lamb, saying, Every one of them, Amen. having every one of them, hearts and God in full of God as which are the prayers of Amen. the Amen. And they sang a new song, Amen. saying, Thou art worthy Hallelujah. to take the book Amen. and open the seals thereof. Amen. For thou hast was slain Amen. and hast redeemed us to God by the blood out of every kindred, Amen. and tongue, and people, and nation. Amen. And has made us unto our God. Kings and priests, Amen. we shall reign on the earth. Amen. Amen. Ata alipo kitwa kile kitabu. Hawa wenye ungai wa ine, na wala wase ishirina wa ine, wakaanguka mbele za manakondo, kila mwenye wawo anakinubi na bitasa vya daabu, kilijama nukato, ambayo ni maombi ya watakati. Amen. Na waimba wimbo mpia wakusema, Wastahili wewe kuitoa hicho kitabu na kujifungua mioyo zake kwa kuwa ulichitwa ukatununua kwa Mungu na kwa kulichitwa ukamnulia Mungu kwa damu yako watu wa kila kabila na jamaa na taifa amen ukawafanya kuwa ufalme na makuani kwa Mungu wetu Hallelujah. Amen. So there was a celebration in the heavens. He took the book. I took Now remember, as a book, it was seen in advance. And also, this has not been done physically. When you read uh, Revelation chapter 7 2021, down that side. And the scripture tells us that the bride of Jesus Christ comes down. And there is a time that you collect all the redeemed of the earth. And the time of revealing, most of the, uh, 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 the Gentile bride had not come. Hallelujah. Amen. The church ages, the ages, the ages, the ages, the the ages, the the ages, the the ages, the the Hallelujah. So the book of redemption. Christ doing what he intended to do and just started. Hallelujah. But he had the authority. He took the book. But he had not claimed his, his, uh, his people yet. The time when he will claim now openly these are the ones that I redeem. These are the ones that came through the blood. These are the ones that I filled with the Holy Ghost. These are the ones who believed in me. All the ages. Remember, the Old Testament bride. By the time. Christ came and died. The Old Testament bride had already been completed. They rose with him. When he rose that day, people like Abraham and so on, they went to the heaven. Hallelujah. Amen. So what was remaining is the Gentile church. Mainly the Gentile church. Hallelujah. Amen. And the remnants of the Jews will come after the church has gone into glory. Who 
mzima Knowing who Knowing Christ How he came down from glory Believing him that way Is eternal life Praise be the name of the Lord What is the opening of the seal's day? Basi kufunua ba kwa mioyo ni nini basi bidili Christ ni kufunua Kristo Oh may God help us Mungu anasaidia 62 10 14 e Amen Very quickly Amen May God help us Mungu anasaidia Amen So in that chapter 5 that's on lango atano Amen Is a preview And the mambo ya kuonekana kimbele of what happened um, when Jesus paid the price for us. Kwa kile kilichotendeka baada ya Kristo kulipa deni kwa ajili yetu. Haleluya. Amen. Amen. And remember, nakumbuka when you go down there, unaposhuka hapo chini, there's a list there like something mentioned to those people who are in need. Kuna jambo lililotajwa kwa wale watu waliokombolewa. Haleluya. Amen. Let's read it. Hebu tusome. Yes. A comment that I want to make before we read 62:10:14b, paragraph 35. He says, "And behold, I heard the voice of many angels round about the throne, and the beasts, and the elders, and the number of them were ten thousand times ten thousand and thousands of thousands, saying with a loud voice, 'What is this alarm? You are not slain to receive power.'" and riches and wisdom and strength and honor and glory and blessing and every creature which is in heaven and on earth and under the earth and such as are in the sea and all that are in them and, and I say blessing and honor and glory Amen. and power be unto him that seated upon the throne Amen. and unto the Lamb forever and ever Nikaona Nikaona nikasikia sauti ya malaika ya malaika wengi pande zote na za kile kile cha enzi na za wale wazee wenye uhai na za wale wazee na hesabu yao ilikuwa 1000 mara 1000 na 1000 mara 1000 amen wakisema kwa sauti kuu asaili mara kondoo aliyeshindwa kupokea uweza na utajiri na ekma na nguvu na eshma na utukufu na baraka amen na kila kiumbe kilicho mbinguni na juu ya inji na chini ya inji na juu ya bahari na vitu vyote vilivyomo ndani yake na nilisikia nikisema amen baraka oh okay never mind so, so you can see naweza ona the explanation there My little palette is just like so many uh, angels ni mayoka ni kwamba ni malaika wengi sana yani watu wengi kila you had him uh, uh, glorify God walimsikia yeye akimtukuza Mungu haleluya but remember nakumbuka this is just in advance hii ni jambo lioneshwa na kimbele and the people that he redeemed na wale watu aliowakomboa revelation kila taifa kila time kila lugha from everywhere kila mahali and not yet come walikuwa bado hawajakuja amen because so the Jews that were in the old testament are the only ones that came up that went up in glory so wa yahudi ndio katika kama kale ndio malengo ya kufundwa kwa kale ilikuwa and the Gentiles were not yet lakini watu wa mataifa walikuwa bado let me tell you wacha leo if you are born again truths believer you are presented in this kama unazaliwa mara ya pili kwa mimi wa kweli ni wakristo na ile jambo ya the celebration hiyo sio sherehe it will be there itakuwa hali it has not taken place but when the tendeka of the lamb has taken the book lakini leo mara kondoa anatoa exactly and without that you cannot be saved bila hiyo uwezi kuokolewa but the claim has not been done lakini ile madai bado hayajatendeka amen haleluya amen paragraph tatifa and the holy spirit Roho mtakatifu always speaks of the word. Hiyo wakati unena juu ya neno I'm commanding to tell you. Akasema I can't understand it now. Akasema nao mengi akwambia lakini hamwezi kuelewa sasa. But when he comes he will guide you to it. Lakini yeye atakukuja ataongoza kwa hai. That's the reason the coming of the sea. 
And the finishing of the seventh seal. The mystery of God should be finished. And then we should know what did the prophet say. We are not talking about now about the rapture of God this way, that way. Um, so, no. That the mystery of God. Yeah, the mystery of God should be finished. Hallelujah. Amen. And God was it. To know who God is. God he is. How he lives. The nature of his being. That is what has been revealed at the opening of the series. The mystery of God. Who God is. What God is. How God lives. The nature of God. His being. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. That's why in the scriptures you hear the prophet say, God does not change. And is his nature. Hallelujah. And he is the same in every manner that he was. What is the manner that he was? Hallelujah. Amen. From the first day, he was a creator. And that manner is the same. From that day, from the beginning, he was the one. And in that manner, he is the same. Glory to God. These are indeed man. That manner has never changed. He is the same here. That manner has never changed. He is the same here. That manner he cannot change. You can see, you can mention all the redempt names of Jesus Christ. All of them, they have never changed. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Oh, may God help us. Amen. Uh, it was an error. 
Sema hiyo ilikuwa ni makosa. It was written down before their heaven was a human being on the earth. Iliandikwa pale hata kabla kujawahi kuwa na mwanadamu yote hapa duniani. Your name. Jina lako. Hallelujah. Amen. If you are Christian listen here. Come and please us kiss us. He didn't know you when you gave your life to Jesus Christ. Sio wewe ulipopeana maisha yako kwa Yesu. You are not saved when Jesus Uh, when you accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The people who receive him. What one am okay? Yet are the seed of God. Ah, on the devil. He knew them. I was even before there was us. Hata kabla hakujakuwa na dunia. Before he spoke the earth into existence. Hapo lake neno ulimwengu na ulimwengu uje kwa. Hallelujah. Amen. He knew you. Alikujua wewe in himself. Yeah. Even before he said let there be hata kabla ya sema na kuacha kuwe let there be heaven and earth kuwe na mbingu na nchi haleluya before he spoke the word kabla ya neno neno amen because a believer is a seed of god kwa sababu maanilio ni mbegu ya mungu we are like into the seed tumefananishwa na mbegu the seed is what makes us what we are mbegu inanufanya tuwe vile tulivyo na haleluya is because you are a seed of your father kwa sababu ni mbegu ya baba yako that's why that's why you look like the way you look kwa sababu unaonekana vile ulivyo it is the seed ile mbegu na because you have the seed of god so wewe una mbegu ya mungu You must look like God. Lazima ufanane na Mungu in nature, maombile in faith, in imani, in power, katika nguvu, in everything. Kila kitu. Amen. 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 Your names were written in the Lamb's book of life. Amen. Majina yetu majina yetu alikuwa katika kitabu cha mwanakondoo cha uzima. Amen. Ushabiti. The scriptures they are written. And the Bible says, "Believe us that Jesus was the Lamb of God slain from the foundation of the world." Baba Yesu Kristo ndiye mwana kondoa Mungu aliyejitwa kabla ya kuka msinga ulimwengu. Amen. Take a quarter of that year so that to material. Hai ikwa miaka ma 2000 hii japo hili ndio kuvirika. Haleluya. Amen. A long time after he spoke. And the great bad of the year then. Haleluya. Amen. It took a long time before uh, the body uh, uh, of Jesus came into the womb of men in his form the red sun of the holy mother of christ who was like a leaf by maria but that this it was spoken first of all it is that it got the name of us and so your names that's what they are we are put on the lamb's book of life yeah you know that the child of mother of god knows of sin before the foundation of the world kabla ya kwa misingi ya ulimwengu i want us to read the scriptures and we go back quote from the prophet Amen amen That's right In this book of redemption How about there I want to just go some just some of the Yes. Naye yuko tayari kupanda 
kutoka kuziku na kwenda kwenye walimu na hao wakaao juu ya enzi wasioandikwa majina yao katika kile kitabu cha uzima tangu kuwekwa misike ulimwengu kwa stadi kwa stadi kwa muona hapo ile mnyama ya kwapa alikuwapo naye ayuko naye atakuwa haleluya ibe how is the judgment is continuing wakati hukumu ikiendelea then those ones who are not written in that book wale ambao hawako katika kile kitabu they will see Satan and his people in their group wataona shetani na watu wake katika makundi yao and be surprised na watashangaa haleluya that they are in that group wapo katika kikundi because they were not written in the in the last book of life kwa sababu hawako katika kile kitabu cha matakondoo they will be in that group wakati ndani Aya 11. Kisha nikaona kiti cha enzi kikubwa cherupe na yeye aliyeke juu yake ambaye inji na mbingu zikakimbia uso wake na mahali pao wakapoonekana. Amen. Nikaona wafu wakubwa kwa wadogo wamesimama mbele ya hicho kiti cha enzi. Amen. Na vitabu vikafunguliwa na kitabu kingine kikafunguliwa ambacho ni cha uzima na hao wafu wakahukumiwa katika mambo hayo yaliyoandikwa katika vile vitabu sawa sawa na matendo yao haleluya na bwana
motive for oh. this plan of redemption. Na upako kongozi. He had you and me in mind. Alikuwa na wewe na mimi katika hali ya somebody that can slay this one oh. to redeem this one. Kama kuna mtu ambaye lazima nimchinje ili nikombee. And you are there. Amen. You are spoken together. Amen. When God spoke the word, he was laying in the earth. Amen. Amen. And the scripture says, Amen. We are associated with the slaying of the Lord. We are associated with the shedding of the blood of Jesus Christ. We are associated with what took place on Calvary. Hallelujah. We are the seed of God. Hallelujah. And the seed of God can never be lost. Praise be the Lord of the Lord. When you are seen, brother, when you are born here, you come on earth with the seed. Hallelujah. And when you come, you come, you start living like everybody else. Hallelujah. Not knowing that you are the seed. Not knowing that you are associated with Christ. But then one day, you will hear the spoken word. Your original seed, which you are dead for this hour. When that seed comes, that touches the original seed that God planted in your heart. Hallelujah, it activates that seed. And you start thinking, I think that is right. I think that is true. I think that is the Bible. Hallelujah. And the seed starts now coming. That's now coming to life. Hallelujah. And you want to hear more. And the talk is here. And the singer says, Elijah, tell me more. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tell me more. Tell me more about the spoken word. What the seed in me is growing. The greatest story in the Bible. How Christ came to from glory. And died for sinners like you and me. The most wonderful story. Hallelujah. In the story of the glorious crucifixion of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Let's read from the pitch between the seven chart pages and the seven seeds. 63 dash 0, 3, 1, 7, 8. It is so important for us that God came in a prophet and revealed the word. And let me tell you what you know. It is enough to make you uh, a professor of, of divinity. Uh, 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 like uh, 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 professor uh, of theology. Hallelujah. But you see, brother. It is the revelation of Jesus Christ, yes. Christ which God gave to our prophet. And and that is what we are believing. Christ has redeemed us now. We are now redeemed. But he has not claimed his possession yet. But he has redeemed us. Now you might differ with that, but just hold on a minute. You see, you see he hasn't claimed it. If he took the book of redemption, everything that Adam had and everything that he lost, 
Ile kiota ambayo Adamu alikuwa nacho na akipoteza the Christ in him Bas Kristo naye alikukomboa akakurudisha. And that's why. Hiyo ndio sababu ni ndani and rose. Alipokufa na akakufuka. He rose with the Old Testament saints all of them. Alikufuka na wale watakatifu wa kale wote. Haleluya. And he said no power is given unto me. Alisema nguvu zote ni kwa Bas. Hapa duniani alikuwa good by sharing the blood. Kwa kumwaga ile dawa. Took back that book. Alitoa hizo kitabu that Adam and and Eve lost. Ambacho Adam na Hawa Like him. Yeah. When we see him, we will be like 
No man knew the Son except the Father, and the Father is known only by whom the, the Son wishes to remain. Baba, Buddha, and Joa, Baba, Wala, Abuda, and Joa, Manila, too. Yeah, we are the Joa, and we are my Baba, and I talk to you. I have to continue. Because in the old Orient, they still have the same thing. The bright group who is going to be married. They give some the invitations and punishes the, the rope to everybody he is, he is invited. Hallelujah. And how my heart spins round and round when I think of it. Amen. No man can come to me except my father gives him an invitation first. Uh -huh. So you know that I am a child of God. And 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 I am a child of God. Before the foundation of the world. How we are going to be seen. Our names are put on the last book of life. But in the end, we are going to be told. Listen here. No, we are going to be seen here. Amen. Because you must have something to show that you are invited. That's why we keep the position of Baba or Yaliwa. Because the bread group stands in the door. So we are going to rush and see Baba Paul in the door. Hallelujah. Amen. The bread group stands in the door. We are going to rush and see Baba Paul in the door. To receive the invited guests. Okay, I will again. I will again. Amen. So our names were put on the last book of life. Why do we have to leave the table? We have to go to the cinema to see the light. Hallelujah. To receive the message of our name. This is the evening light. To the evening time. To shine the light. Amen. Our names were put there. So that we could see the light. Hallelujah. Amen. Now that we have seen the light of the cross. We have seen it, brother. Nobody can stop us from seeing. To see the light, to receive the Holy Ghost, to walk in it. Our names were put there. But when God sends a message with a message, in the light of this world, when we see God manifesting His word for the hour, which is the light, that we could see it and believe it. Brother, oh, hallelujah. Thank you. He took the invitation. 
not knowing what they are doing. Hivyo ndio sababu watu uingilia mambo kufanya huko na huko bila kujua kile wanachofanya. God is sovereign in this world. Mungu na kipekee sana katika maisha. Now find him at the beginning. Na pata pale mwanzo. Are we ready there? Uko tayari pale? His attributes. Yaani zile sifa zake. And now, na sasa you were with him then. Wewe ulikuwa pamoja na yeye pale at the beginning. Pale mwanzo you were with him then. Ulikuwa pamoja naye How many believe that? You are going to believe. Exactly. You better believe. Hey, you are me. Even if you don't understand, just believe. 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 And we read over here in Revelation in the 13th chapter 8 that the the peace that comes upon the earth in the in these last days so we will receive all those people on the earth who need to not fit in the lab book book of, of, of life before the foundation of the world. So my father can go from now to the end. As we are going to go to the end of the world, we are going to go to the end of the world. Jesus in God's mind. Jesus in God's mind. Yesu katika ile nia ya Mungu died for the sins of the world. Alikufa kwa ajili ya dhambi za ulimwengu. And the book of life was made. Na kile kitabu cha uzima and your name was put on that book of life. Na jina lako liko katika ile kitabu cha foundation of the world. Kabla ya kuwa mzima. That is the Bible too. Huo ni ukweli wa Biblia. Haleluya. Amen. You are need. Jina lako was ordained of God. Yaani ilikufikiwa na kimbele na Mungu. Haleluya. Amen. You are ordained to live a holy life. Ulikusudiwa na kimbele kuishi maisha matakatifu. Yes, we in the book of Ephesians. Hebu tusome katika kitabu cha Waefeso. Amen. Amen. Mshachoka. Can we can we can close kama mshachoka. Amen. Amen. Ephesians chapter one. Ephesians chapter one. Ephesians chapter one. Ephesians chapter one. According as he has chosen us in him before the foundation of the world, and and that we should be holy and without blame. Before him in love. Kama vile alilotuchagua katika yeye kabla ya kuweka misingi ulimwengu ili tuwe watakatifu watu wasio na hatia mbele zake katika mema. Having been designated as into the adoption of children by Jesus Christ himself according to the good pleasure of his will. Kwa kuwa alitangulia kutuchagua ili tupande wanawe kwa njia ya Yesu Kristo. Hallelujah. Amen. So you can see the revelation of the church and the believer. Amen. The church and the believer. Yaani kanisa na muamilio. Amen. We are ordained. Wote walisikiwa na kimbele. Our names. Majina yetu. We are ordained. Yaani kwa kimbele na Mungu and placed on the book of uh, of life. Na yakawekwa katika kile kitabu cha uzima. Hallelujah. Once he puts it there. Anapokeojina pale. And you are born here. Na umezaliwa hapa. There's no way you can deny Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. Hakuna njia unaweza kukana Yesu Kristo kwa Bwana na uongozi wako. Hallelujah. You were there in his attributes. Ulikuwa pale katika ile sifa yake. Hallelujah. You were there. Ulikuwa pale. And he says you don't remember it. Wanasema lakini haukumbuki hiyo. Yeah, you don't remember. That you are there. Baba wewe ulikuwa pale. How many remember that they were there? Ni wale kama nikukumbuka kwamba alikuwa mule mbinguni. Yeah, you don't remember. Wewe kumbuka? Haleluya. Amen. Yes, you don't remember. Wewe kumbuka of the way that we came. Kwa sababu ile njia ndio kujia hapa naye. You don't remember it. Wewe kumbuka? No. 
Because you are just a part of his life. We ni sehemu tu ya ule uhai wake. You are just part of his life. Ulikuwa sehemu ya uhai wake. You are part of God when you become a son or daughter of God. Na wewe ni sehemu ya Mungu unapofanyika mwana wa Mungu ama binti wa Mungu. You are there hidden in his life. Ulikuwa pale umepitwa na ile uhai wake. He is thoughts. Katika mawazo yako. Like a child the prophet says like I saw in my father, you know you can have children, but you, uh, the children can't remember how they were in their father. But you know what, you can't remember how they were in their father. Hallelujah. Because they were just a seed there. So, father, you can't part of the life of the father. Say, why, you can't remember how they were in their father. Now, this attribute, the attribute was first God,
And if for any reason that name must be removed. Na pengine kwa na sababu yote basi hilo jina laweza ondolewa. Now that is uh, what what goes on in the translation. Hiyo ile ambayo inaendelea katika Bible. Now upon again then your book uh, is taken from the book uh, the other books then it is put on the book uh, in the Lamb's book of life. Na sema unapo zaliwa mara ya pili jina lako laondolewa katika kitabu cha kifo kingifo katika kitabu cha maraozo ya uzito. If you misbehave you can take it away. Na kama uko na tabia ambayo haistahili jina laweza ondolewa basi kifo any reason that name must be removed. Yeye katika sababu yote ile jina laweza ondolewa the space of that record will simply be a blank as it was before a name had been placed there. Maanisha kwamba hiyo sehemu ilikuwa haijaandikwa kitu kama ile jina alijaandikwa pale. Yeah, inakaa wazi. Ina simekuta hapa nimekuta haina namna hii. Sasa hapo panakaa hivyo hivyo. Kama vile kwa kabla ya jina haijaandikwa. Amen. The process this is 100% opposite to what the actual the what what the word actually teaches. Anasema na sababu hii ni kinyume na asilimia pia mia kwa kile ambacho neno wanafundisha. And at the very beginning start of our study let it be known that there is not one scripture that teaches that God is presently compiling a record of names. Na katika mafundisho yetu pale mwanzo kijulikana kwamba kimaandiko hakuna mali nafundisha kwamba Mungu hivi sasa kuna orodha ya majina anayoandika is compiling ama anaunganisha one by one huyu anaamini na maandiko huyu anaamini na maandiko aha even it before alitenda huko in the heavens amen this was all done before the foundation of the world hii yote itendwa kabla ya ulimwengu kwao we will point out shortly kama vile vya vya sema hivi kaibudu haleluya also pia it is not a question of simply involving ourselves in the two groups of asi swala kwa sisi kujihusisha na aina mbili ya kundi la watu onde pekee ndio hawa wanaweza kutolewa hawa wana a a a god did it himself mungu alitenda yeye mwenyewe haleluya and remember na kumbuka that's why people some people don't have faith in receiving anything from the law kwa sababu watu wengi hawana imani ya kukea kitu chochote kutoka kwa bwana nobody can remove any Hakuna mtu yeyote anayezondoa ile jina of course a name to be placed. Ama sababisha jina liandikwe. No. Da. Everything is done. Kila kitu kilichatendeka. God is just waiting for this one to manifest and that one to manifest. Mungu anakoja tu huyu adhirike na yule adhirike. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Oh may God help us. Amen. This is the our brother. Huyu ni ile sana na those people Hawa who get confused. Ambao wamechanganyikiwa. Ah those people who are names are not written. Ni ndio wale watu ambao majina yao hayakuandikwa. I want to warn you believers. Nataka ni waone ni wale wao huko na affinity na watu wana wanapendwa kwa doctrine huku na wanaenda kwa sababu ni muaminio. Kwa sababu ana anasoma kwa utumbe. Na kuambia you don't know huyu jina lake iko ama haiko. Amen. Ha, anafanya hivyo anaconfuse hayo mambo kwa sababu haelewi na hawezi kuelewa wala wala hataelewa hata siku moja kama bibi sisi tunaona madhebu madhebu wa Kikristo Biblia ni hii wanasoma hivyo hata ukoonyesha ya kwamba hapa imeandikwa ya kwamba ana watu wa subiri anasema ah ta ata kupatia explanation nyingine nyingine lakini ndeta kwa amani ni kwamba lazima hapa fanye muonyesha kitu basic basic kitu ya kawaida kama ubatizo kwa jina la Yesu Kristo hata useme hakuna mtu amebatizwa hivyo hata hivi huko ndani ya dunia kwa 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 kweli mpaka tu kwa kweli hapa anasema tubatizwe hivi na hapa kitu amefanya hivi so ni nini sasa hivi airi ya nakwambia ni sawa hata ukimachoko kwa jina ya baba wala tunapitia na kwa jina la Yesu ni sawa lakini yeye hawezi kubatizwa kwa jina la Yesu Kristo kama kama ni priest hawezi kubatizwa kwa jina la Yesu Kristo kama na kama yeye hawezi kubatizwa kwa jina la Yesu Kristo kama anaona ni the same thing sikio kama mnanipata amen ni kwa sababu haoni kwa hiyo there is a spiritual cover kuna kitu some remaining spiritual uh, law ni kwa hapo 
even when the seals are open, there is a, an element of, 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 of cover that remains until Christ reveals it to the person. Like in Matthew 16. And they said, what, what do people say? And that's what they say, like uh, Elias, or like Jeremiah, and so on. So on. And say, but what about you? And Peter says, you are where we need the, the, the Christ, the Son of the Living God. Christo, Mara, and, and, and the Lord says, Blessed are you. Because flesh and blood did not reveal this to you. Amen. But my Father who is in heaven has revealed this to you. And the revelation is sent directly. God, from God to a person personally. Even now, as it is going on, there are people who are receiving the revelation direct from God, and they are seeing it. And others are seeing it from here out to there. From here out to the end, they are not seeing it. But they will see it one time or another. If they are written, their names are written on that book. Like what happened to the disciples? Peter saw it at the beginning. But much later, the other, the other disciples saw it. When they saw that he was they knew their thoughts of their mind. They said, Oh, now we know that you don't have to be told anything. So now they have known by the revelation from on high. So even where we are. There are people who don't even know how God became one. Why? Why? We are saying we have one God. Why? 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 Hallelujah. Amen. To know how God became flesh. But they believe there is one God. But they cannot connect by the word. Because it is not yet revealed to them. And if their names were put on the Lamb's Book of Life, God will reveal it to them. Praise be the name of the Lord. Amen. There those who don't understand why we should be filled with the Holy Ghost. And yet we are we are living a, a life, a holy life. They can't connect with the Bible. But brother, let me tell you, if they are a seed of God, God who put the seed there, we will receive, we will reveal the baptism of the Holy Ghost to them. And they will go for it. Hallelujah. Amen. And they will receive it. Now I don't care. Bless them in the name of the Lord. Amen. Oh, may God help us. Amen. Mm. Amen. Amen. I don't know. Amen. Amen. So you can go and complete uh, reading that portion of the scriptures. Mm. Amen. Let's go back to the finish on the on the bridge. The three that still up three one seven e paragraph two ninety seven. What are you really going on in heaven? You believe in a guy in the level of the good when that lamb leaves and leaves that thing and leaves that intercessory uh box. Now we are to possess his claims. 
na haja hapa kumiliki yale madai yake that was shown in advance hii ilionyesha na kimbele this celebration here huko hii sherehe hapa has not taken place kwa bado haijatendeka au ni together kwa pamoja because some people of this hapa na region here and says no the the lambas left the throne now haya watu kujenga isia kama rema properly and see what is it you know that god take uh, next uh, you know that god next to john you know that god next to john unajua kwamba hiyo iko pale yohana the mass of sin is named god there lazima aliona hiyo jina lake inaandikwa my dead seems bro wakati ile neno lilipovuni he must have got real happy lazima alifurahisha this is what he said ile kitu na joseph every picture which is in heaven and on earth and under the earth kila kitu kilicho mbinguni hapa duniani na chini ya dunia such as within the sea kama vile vilivyo baharini oh in them there is in them na yale yote leo ndani yao had me as i say uh, blessings and honor and glory and power Give him that seat from the throne. Nilisikia mimi nikisema baraka na heshima na utukufu na nguvu kwa yule aliyekeni juu yake. Amen. And to the lamb forever. Na kwa maana kondoo bila. And the four beasts say amen. Na wale wanyama waina wanasema amen. And the four beasts say the third and the fourth team that lives forever and ever. Na wale wazee shina hiyo wakainama na kwa mabudu yule anaishi bila na bila. Kwa sababu ya jubile ya kuhusu yubilo kwa kwa time when the lamb walk for ya kuhusu ya kuhusu ya wakati ya mbo yule mwanakondo hakitoka and the book is here uh, is even sealed in heaven na kile mystery is a na kile kizapo kilichotua muhuri na kile miuri yake say uh, is my name there akasema je jina lamu liko pale says i don't know i hope it is Sijui lakini natumai jina langu liko pale na sasa prophet said. Yule nabii akisema if it is kama iko pale put on the book before the foundation of the world. Ile hapa pale kile kitabu kabla ya kwako misinge ulimwe. But lakini the first thing japo la kwanza that is presented that redemption. Ya boy japo wakilisha huo ukombozi. Come the lamb that had been slain from the foundation of the world. Anakuja mwanakondo hapa aliyechinjwa kabla ya kwako misinge ulimwe. The first thing is presenting redemption what yeah, i see the lamb taking the book la ina wasilisha ukombozi kisha tuone yule mwanakondoo anitoa kile kitabu open the book na atoa kile kitabu na afungue kile kitabu of the seals na akavunja kile kitabu and send it down to the earth na akazituma huko duniani to the seventh angel kwa wale malaika wake saba the seventh angel to see yule malaika wa saba to reveal it to his people ili afunue hilo kwa watu wake there you are hapo ndipo ulipo oh my what happened nini kinatukia amen this the screen to the shouts of the hallelujah that is like lele shangu na hallelujah the anointing the power the glory the majesty of power na nguvu na utukufu na madhiri that has happened jambo la kwanza lo tukia after the uh, the lamb took the book baada ya mwanakondoo kutoa kitabu then he was distributing the, the redemption plan to every person ya baada ya kila seventy one akipeana na mpango kuongoza kila mjumbe mpaka ule mjumbe wa mwisho under the seventh seal chini ule mburi wa saba and all John who had been standing there na ule Yohana wa kale alikuwa akisimama pale oh brother crying dunia tu pale akilia what he said everything in heaven kila kitu mbele everything in earth kila kitu duniani na ndani ni mihola amen amen kilisikia mimi nikipiga kelele amina amina amen talk about a happy time that you say who's your god you know fra when the seals broke ni wakati leo miuri ile kwa good god must have looked in you want to see but it's not about the time it seems a past the curtain of time na kaona ile kambo ya pili hapa sia eh akavunja uko eh kaona upande ule mwingine eh and say there is god na akasema hapo kuna yohana haleluya eh don't let me see the list see at the lone lord of the king no so so the people aliona pia watu and him in the in the people na yeye alikuwa miongoni mwa wale wa there is god na hapo pia yohana alikuwa he was so happy alikuwa na furaha haleluya everything in heaven he must have a really cried out lazima kila kitu kumbe akilia sana everything kila kitu haleluya eh 
Why? When the, when the revelation comes, that the Lamb, the Redeemer, our kinsman, might, might come back from the throne of Petrotorio and had walked out here to take his possession. And that portion he has not done. But he has taken the book for redemption. But you see that. And that's why he has given the message for us to be saved. Hallelujah. If it was at the time when the revelation came to him, and that, that now he came to take the possession, or claim the possession, then we would not have been saved. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. All right. So the Lamb will take uh, his bride to be ever at his side. Amen. Because it is being spoken in advance. Amen. That Amen. Amen. the sequence of things. Amen. And I put it in the mouth of the Lamb. Amen. Like you Amen. Soon the, the Lamb will take his bride to be ever at his side. All the hosts of heaven will assemble in That is the song that, that we normally sing. Amen. Hallelujah. How oh, may God help us? It is a, such a great thing to see, wanna, to see how God redeemed us. And how he brought that revelation to us. So that you cannot leave this message here. This message here. You can't leave it. Where's what? People are the seed, you can never be lost. You can never be lost. Hallelujah. Amen. You can never denounce this message. You can never denounce the messenger. For everything that God has done on this planet. Because you are part of that plan. Hallelujah. You are the seed of God. That we hear Jesus. Jesus Christ saying, the farmer went to plant, and he planted the seed, and then at night, another person went in that same chamber, and planted another seed, hallelujah, Amen. and they wanted to, 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 uh, to uproot the the tears from, from the from the farm. Now I don't know the level of my and a book to leave them. You might even hurt the wheat. Hallelujah. Amen. But it will be done in the last day. They will be gathered. In batches. The tire tears will be gathered fast. And that's what is happening. In denominational tears. Many groups. And groups. And groups. But the bride is from the churches. Amen. Even here, I believe she's here. Hallelujah. But she's not alone. The tears are also here. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Glory to God. Amen. There's no church for the same but No, they are there. Amen. And believers the fornicators, but their notice is there. Amen. Let me tell you where we are going. 
Let us straighten your life. Where we are going. Where Christ brings the gifts. It's a perfect operation. When you call out the coordinators. The gifts. Waisi. The, the adulterers. Wazizi. Yeah. The good men. Wow, amen. And the good women. And so on and so forth. What yeah. The, the, the wife beat us. All of them. What? They will be called out in every meeting. The baby himself will read out all the, the things that are not right. Hallelujah. Amen. And I pray for that giver of the perfect gifts to come. I need him here. I need him here in Araji. He is the giver yeah. of eternal life. He is a giver of good gifts. I want him here. Hallelujah. Yeah. He is a giver of perfect ministries. I want him here. Brother yeah. and sister. That is why we are here. Glory to God. Amen. This is the hour. That was predicted in the Old Testament. Hallelujah. That in the last days. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Where are the two the two spirits are so close? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. That if it were possible, you come a in your head in the name of the Lord. Amen. That it is not possible. Papa, you jump away with the very elect. The guy of the road. That's the important brother. You're the only one who is breaking up the sea. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Oh. Hmm. I hope you see your names there. I don't know that you At the end of everything, I hope you see your names. Hallelujah. And this is not about uh, somebody being a lunatic. I see Jabala and No. Now, here in the message of the hour, for the people whose names are written, they are not lunatics here. They are no crazy people. Here they are all saying people. Hallelujah. But they display the power of God. In a same way, they go for it. When they are there, they are there, they are there, where is the other one? No, we are not. 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 We